liftoff of the Atlas V. NASA's Magnetospheric Multiscale Mission, or MMS, is on its way. A quartet of matched satellites launched Thursday evening aboard an Atlas V rocket. Once the satellites are in place, they'll give scientists the best look yet at magnetic reconnection. Magnetic reconnection occurs when a magnetic field, usually that of a celestial body, gets violently rearranged. When the sun's magnetic field undergoes reconnection, for example, you get solar flares. On Earth, it contributes to the auroras. The phenomenon can also disrupt electronics and pose hazard to spacecrafts or astronauts. MMS has made it to orbit, so there can be a small celebration, but NASA's engineers say it will take several weeks to deploy and arrange the quartet of satellites. Fully extended, the booms on each one reach 496 feet, or roughly across a baseball field. That's when the real science party can start. MMS will study Earth's own magnetosphere as a sort of laboratory. The satellite's orbit will take them both to the magnetopause, where Earth's magnetic field first encounters the solar wind, and to the tail of the magnetosphere behind the planet. The data will help scientists understand how and why magnetic reconnection works in other celestial bodies, such as the sun or black holes. It can also help them predict solar storms or improve magnetic containment systems in nuclear fusion reactors. Measurements are expected to start in September once the MMS satellites have been arranged in their final configuration. For Newsy, I'm Jasmine Bailey.